Uh, there was a time we were going to the, a restaurant to use the restroom as a group and as we were on our way over right by on the bench outside the restaurant there was a lady and a man sitting and they just got off the bus um, and they were waiting for the next one and I just felt drawn to the gentleman that was sitting there and and I asked my friend M who was walking with us because she could translate I said could you translate for me and I asked him if he was had any pain in his body and he seemed to not have any but then the lady sitting next to him started grabbing her knee and she started to explain that she's had issues with her knees for a lot of years and so we started praying and she felt heat on her legs and then she got healed and she could all the pain had went away and she was excited well the gentleman who was sitting next to her i thought it was her husband it was not he like left and i thought oh i wonder if he was offended i wasn't sure but he then came back around the corner and called em and i to go to his wife who she was working in the restaurant well, it turns out she needed healing in her body. And when he saw God heal this lady, he got excited and went and got her. And at that time, Kristen showed up and she followed us around the corner and came with us. And we prayed for the lady and she got healed. And then she wanted to share the gospel yeah. with her. She gave her life to Jesus and uh, then went back to work in the kitchen. Yeah. That was really good. So it's a lesson, it's an encouragement to, to pay attention to promptings feel drawn to somebody you're not even sure why hey do you have any pain in your body do you need anything and it was just a series of one divine appointments after another and again we get to give some follow-up material to that family we had two people healed one person give their life to the lord and god's doing the same thing right here in the states